Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I have a couple of um, older products and a couple of new products and a couple of products that I'm trying out for the very first time. So I thought I'd go ahead and get started. And I have, um, let's see, the Kosas in shade 110 on. And that's what I have on as far as the base. And then I do have the Pretty Fresh Concealer by ColourPop on. That's my concealer today. As far as my blushes, these are two blushes I got last year. I pulled them out yesterday to see if they actually um, had dried up on me, and they hadn't. And this is a Cover Girl, or Cover Girl uh, Clean Fresh Cream Blush. I have shade 330 and 390, so that's the way they look there. Um, I did go ahead and do swatches of them, and this is the 330 that I have on today, and this one is the 390. And then what I did was I went ahead and put the Heroin Glow 2 by Juvia's Place over the top of it. Uh, this is one of their highlighters. I actually used it as a... Um, as a topper for my blush today and so I put it all over the top and it gives it a nice glowy um, kind of fun look and kind of finished the look off so again uh, really liking this one and um, this one I actually had given to my mom but she didn't really like it so I traded her a couple of things and I got this one back so um, yeah that's how that worked out there and then I also did use Flexitarian by ColourPop as far as uh, my actual highlighter so this I used as a blush topper and this was my actual highlighter and then as far as the rest of the look goes um, I did go ahead and use the ColourPop. This is from their Celestial um, series, and this one is Clearly in Love. And um, it doesn't really seem the right name for a Celestial. I mean, you could call it Celestine or Celestial or something, or, you know, Star Surfer or something. But that's what they called it, so um, that's what I have on today. This is their newer uh, formula, so these two top rows up here are going to be more of a cream formula. And um, then the bottom rows are going to be um, the regular formula. Uh, there are actually two shades that have the sequin formula and that's this one and this one up here. And so they're both uh, regular mattes. They just have some sequins in there. As far as what I went ahead and did today, I used uh, this one on my inner corner and then this one again on the inner corner. Um, and I used, uh, let's see, this one on the crease and then I used some of this in the crease as well. Uh, under the eyebrow, I went ahead and used uh, this one. On the lid itself, I used this one. On the brow bone, I went ahead and used this one. And so as far as uh, the way that the eye look came out, well, I also used the ColourPop Gel Eyeliner, and this one is sort of a wine color. And this is the way that the eye look came out. Sort of like that. And um, I'm liking these palettes a lot. They definitely give you a lighter, well, they blend, they're creams, so they blend together in a different way. And they definitely give you more of a lighter feel as far as the colors go. And so um, that's what I have on there. Um, as far as new to me, I got the Kelly Ray Mascara. I picked it up in Sephora, the mini. And that's what I have on my eyelashes today. I'm finding that it adds a lot of length, but this is a first impression, so I haven't really worn it to see if it smudges or anything like that yet. Well, there goes everything on the floor. And um, the Beauty Pie, the Triple Beauty Perfect Glow Powder, uh, that's what I have on as my face powder or finishing powder today. This one's from Beauty Pie and it is very shimmery and so I yeah I love shimmery powders they're just me so um that's kind of what I have on today and this is how the look turned